Okay guys, so in this next video, we're gonna show you again the process of registering some B2G files. Um, it's a really nice data, data set actually from uh, New Orleans that one of our colleagues captured. So you can see here, this is just one of the single B2Gs. And another aspect of Reality Cloud Studio that you might notice is that we're able to bring a really nice color rendition to the data to make everything really jump off the screen. Now, what we're gonna do here Again, it's just look at a couple of those different scans. You know, this one here you can see is of the outskirts of that, uh, of that town square. And we're gonna use the automatic registration tools to bring all of that together. But the key point here is we're also gonna show you how meshing those data sets can help you clean them. Um, so we're just gonna give it a name. We're gonna hit auto register as we did before. Um, but we're not gonna wait for the real time process to finish. Uh, if we quickly now look at one that we did earlier, we'll just jump back into the previous folder. And what we've done with this data set is actually gone one step further. We've used the um, automatic mesh creation that in Reality Cloud Studio to deliver a nice final result. And just to remind you, this is all streaming over the web. This is all being brought directly into the browser in real time. So what you can see here is just coming on a, you know, a standard internet connection at home. But what you can see on the screen now is the noise from the, uh, the BLK to go data where we've walked through a very, very busy street um, and just to highlight that, we'll just put that shading method on so you can see all of that noise. And as soon as we flip to the mesh mode, all of that noise has been removed from the data sets. So that's another one of the very key tools within Reality Cloud Studio that empowers your workflows.